really excited about what I found in Forever 21 today because as you all know, it is so difficult being a thick girl in an Asian country. Like, as far as sizing for anything, shoes, clothes, jackets, anything, it's just so difficult. So when I finally find something, I'm like, what? <laughs> so I'm gonna talk to you guys about some of the stuff that I found. I found some really, 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 really cute stuff. And of course, they're having like this huge sale. So like, you know how, you know, my true shoppers, you know, they have the end of the season sale where they're like trying to get rid of all their winter gear and everything. So I looked up and found some really, really good deals. I'm gonna go ahead and hop right into it. I'm gonna start off with boots. Now, like I said, being thick and live, living in an Asian country is so hard to find over the knee boots or just boots, period, to come over my thick ass calves. It's so difficult. But I found something I'm super excited And the color that I found them in was this nice, like, dark taupe color. And these are the boots. They go above the knee and they're like faux suede. I'm. I'm just in love. They have this like stretchy material at the top. So it goes, I can have on jeans, I can wear shorts, I can wear a cute midi skirt, whatever, it doesn't even matter. It's gonna come up and it's gonna stay. And it stays too, by the way. So um, these are the boots. Um, I ended up getting these for 50 bucks. I was willing to pay for these because I've been looking for some over the knee boots for so long and I finally found some in this color and I just thought they were really cute. Little flat boots. I thought they were really cute. Next, this bag is really loud. Next, I found these simple black boots. I've been looking for some simple, just straight up black suede boots for so long. And I finally found them in Forever 21. And they have the little elastic on the back. My thick leg girls, you know what I mean. Very important, I finally found some. They're flat as well. And these don't necessarily go above the knee. They kind of stop maybe like right below the knee, but it's it's perfect. And I know I'm fa I found them late in the in the season, but hey, you know, it get, it stays cold until about late April. So I still have a couple more months. And plus I have fashion weekend. I really wanted some long boots. These boots ran me $50 as well. They were worth it though. These are so cute. Um, next I'm gonna go straight into um, just keeping into shoes. I got these shoes from Zara. I got them on sale for 40 bucks regularly 90 and they're just some cute simple platform black boots. As you can see I've already done wore them. They are so comfortable. Platform boots are just they're just easier to wear and they're easier on the feet as you can see as a thick sole here and it just stops like midway on the ankle. Perfect with a pair of jeans, a skirt, or anything, or if you just want to dress up a simple outfit, you can just throw these on and they're perfect. I got them from Zara on sale, end of the season sale. Holla at me. Next from Zara as well. These little cute little sock booty things. I'm pretty sure there's a proper name for them. I just don't know. But they are super cute to me. They have like the little gold trim on this little about two inch heel. I don't know if you can see about on this two inch heel and they're just really cute in the front looks like they have like a little sock in them i just thought they were really cute i actually wore them today when i went to the mall i wore them with some simple leggings <laughs> i wore them with some simple leggings yes close the door close the door thank you <laughs> sorry that was my son i wore them with some simple black uh, what would you call these? I don't even know what you would call these. I just wore them with some leggings and I did this little shirt and dressed it up with this black necklace. Just a cute little simple shoe with a gold trim. I just thought they were really cute. I ended up getting them from 20 bucks and they were regularly 80. So, oh yeah, what a steal. Next, what I what else I got from Forever 21 is this long trench coat. I just love the color of this coat. I wasn't even supposed to be in there looking at jackets, but this long coat is just to die for. 
It has like the simple look, uh, you know, inspector gadget look cut to it. Has the little um, gold buttons on the shoulders and it ties at the waist. And it's pretty long, actually. And it has pockets. I just thought this was really cute and I just really couldn't like put it back. Like I picked it up and I found my size and I was like, you don't need it. And then I never put it back. And so it's at my house now. I get this. I paid full price for this. I did. I did. But I just love long trench coats and this was 50 as well. I really was not supposed to spend this much money. I really wasn't. But I just really can't wait this guy. I just have a thing for long coats. They're just so chic and you can just throw it on with any simple outfit and you look like... Oh, what was that? Walking down the street. Okay. Next what I got from Forever 21 was this really, really cute. Not only like bodycon dresses, not because I have a gut, it is because I have a gut, but also because it's just too many girls, it's just, it's just bodycon, bodycon, bodycon. I just get tired of seeing it, but this one was really sexy. It has the sheer, um, the sheer lines. And it's a, it's probably about like a midi skirt once you go around all my fatness. And it has a sheer lines all the way down to about where the thigh hits. I thought this was really, really sexy. My husband actually picked this out for me. I haven't tried it on yet, but I'm pretty sure it'll look good. And it's black. You can wear black, you know, black can hide anything. But I was thinking if I did this with one of the trench coats that I already have, I thought that'd be really, really cute. Really, really sexy for a date night. Or, you know, just when I want to be sexy just because. Next, we're going to go into shades. Now, I really have this thing for shades, right? Um, I just, I, I have a thing for everything. Let me just stop saying I have a thing. I have a thing for everything. If it's cute, I want it and give it to me. Now, these shades are, these shades are bomb.com. These are some matte black cat eye sunglasses with the gold on the side first of all y'all <laughs> what you gonna tell her when you see her not a dig on thing these ones is so fly like i had to get them i asked my husband and honestly if he would have told me he didn't like them i don't care i would have still got them i think these are so fly just some simple matte black cat eye glasses with the gold trim on the side and then it has like the ombre black in the front i just thought was just too fly like <laughs> uh, uh. Anywho, the next shades I got were I always wanted some well first of all I've never been a fan of reflective glasses like the reflective uh, paint on the glasses but these were really really cute I thought these were real real cute they're uh, like silver and they have like the extra frame outside frame to go around the glasses I thought these was real dope so if I want to lurk or stare at somebody, they can't even see my eyes. I'll just be staring right at them. They don't even know it. <laughs> okay, lastly, what I got from Zara is this really cute leather tank top. This is like, I just really, really love this. It's like very clean cut, deep V in the front, also deep V in the back. And it's just a regular box cut tank top i would wear this with a pair of distressed jeans or the blaze on top or in the summertime i would just wear this with some distressed shorts and maybe like some single sole sandal heels i don't know i just thought this was really really sexy and really really simple and chic and you can really dress this up in many ways i got this from zara on sale for 10 bucks basically regularly 30 dollars don't sleep on these sales. Don't sleep on them. And lastly, what I got from Zara. I've actually fell in love with these little slit top things. I don't even know what you would call them. It's like the little slits on the side. And they're just really, really long. And I'm really into like just buying simple tops and just dressing it up with accessories, sunglasses, scarves, jackets, and whatnot. So I have like maybe four, five, about four or five of these. I just love them. I have one in navy blue, gray, and one in khaki, and then this color. I thought 
thought I just think they're really cute and they have a little slit on the side and then like if you want to show a little bit more I would tie it in the knot. I really like these little tops um I got this this top I don't even know I took the tag off because I was gonna wear it but then I changed my mind um I think I paid roughly maybe 10 bucks for this and then it was like regularly 25 classic you can't go wrong so that is it as far as my clothes and like my favorite date because I had a couple people ask me questions about this hair just real quick. I haven't tried to flat iron this hair. Um, quite frankly, I wouldn't flat iron this hair. Not because I'm not saying that it could, but I don't know. I just don't think it would have the same effect if I flat iron it because it's so curly. I would like literally have to like take this out, boil it like just re redo the texture in a whole so I, I don't know i would i personally would not flat iron his hair but so far like i said it's doing really good i do notice some shedding like i said when i wet it and wash it whatever and just let it air dry and i try to kind of front finger comb through it to make it a little bit bigger it does shed a little bit but other than that this hair is bomb i give it about when's my next hair appointment <laughs> I'm going to give it about two two more weeks and then I'm going to have a new style. I can't personally hold a, a hairstyle. Y'all going to figure it out about me. Um, I, I change my hair often. Um, but anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video and got some tips. And hopefully y'all can go out and catch these sales before they end. Um, don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see y'all next week.